Hi there, Bookworms. And business enthusiasts, welcome back to the Business Book Review. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of finance and human behavior with a review of The Psychology of Money by Morgan Housel. If you're ready to uncover the secrets behind our financial decisions, stay tuned because we've got some valuable insights coming your way. But just before we do, please do subscribe and hit the notification bell. It just means you're gonna get more of these videos each week. So, the key takeaways. The psychology of money. Morgan Housel's The Psychology of Money explores the often overlooked aspect of finance, our own psychology. One of the key takeaways is that money is more about behavior than it is about dollars and cents. Housel brilliantly delves into the irrational, emotional, and unpredictable side of financial decision making. The importance of temperance. Housel emphasizes the significance of temperance, uh, where it comes to managing money successfully. He argues that your temperance or your ability to stay calm and rational during market fluctuations is often more critical than your intelligence or analytical skills. Understanding the impact of emotions on financial decisions is crucial for building a long-term wealth. The power of compounding. Another gem from this book is the power of compounding. Housel illustrates how time and consistency play a pivotal role in wealth creation. By showcasing real life examples, he drives home the points that small, consistent actions over time can lead to significant financial success. It's a lesson in patience and the magic of compound returns. Adaptability and learning from mistakes. Housel explores the idea that financial success is not about avoiding mistakes, but rather about learning from them. The ability to, to adapt, rather, and evolve in response to life's financial challenges is a recurring theme. The book encourages us to view setbacks as opportunities for growth and to continuously redefine our approach to money management. Defining what enough means. The psychology of money challenges the conventional notion of enough. Housel suggests that defining what is enough for us personally is a crucial step in achieving financial contentment. By understanding our values and priorities, we can make more intentional decisions about our money and avoid the trap of perpetual dissatisfaction. And that just about wraps it up um, on our journey into The Psychology of Money by Morgan Housel. This book is not just about finance, it's a deep dive into the human psyche and how it intersects with our financial decisions. Whether you're a seasoned investor or just starting out to building your financial literacy, this one is a must read. If you've enjoyed it, don't forget to review, hit the like button and do subscribe for more bookish content each week. And let us know your thoughts in the comments. Until next time, happy reading and smart investing.